Okay, this tutorial is all about putting uh, a hard drop shadow into text or applying it into text. And we're also going to talk about uh, soft drop shadows in, uh, in Corel Draw. So first, uh, I've created or I've typed in this, uh, this text here. Say for example, that's my title. And I'll just zoom in here. And uh, what I'm going to do here, the principle of a drop, a hard drop shadow is just to duplicate the exact same text and then put a black fill and put it behind the red text here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click on the um, my title. Okay, I go to edit and I'm going to duplicate it or you can do control D for duplicate. So now I have two uh, exactly the same font and text. What I'm going to do with the uh, with the uh, with the other one, I'll make it black, right? And then I'll put it behind the red text. Okay. Since it's not behind the the, the red text, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to arrange. You go to order, because we're going to change the order. We're gonna going to put it behind. So click on behind, and then Corel draw ask a behind what object. So behind, there's an arrow there, and click on the red text. And there you go. And if you take a look here, we can move the offset of the text. Okay. Now, let's do the other drop shadow. Okay, I'm going to duplicate this again. Edit, duplicate, and put this over here. Now we're going to do the soft drop shadow. So you click on the text or the object, okay, and then you go to this toolbar here and just press it. And you're going to see lots of options here. What we want to choose is the interactive drop shadow. So that's the third option here, interactive drop shadow. Now, in interactive drop shadow you have to click on the text and drag it to the left or to the right or to the top but we're going to mimic this one so we're just going to put it to the lower right corner and then you just release it there you go a nice drop shadow nice soft drop shadow and that's it for the tutorial